Hi everyone, welcome back to the foundation level course on Unix and Linux. This session I will be discussing about what an operating system is and what Unix and Linux is all about. Guys, does anyone know what an operating system is? Uh, I have an answer. As per my knowledge, I have a Windows operating system on my laptop. So when I power on my computer, it will take some time to load all the files. Then it will ask me to give the password. Once I give the password, it starts my computer and it performs all the functions that is required by me. You're exactly right. Let me also put it in a right way. So basically, an operating system is a software that supports computer's functions such as scheduling tasks, executing applications, and controlling different external devices such as printers, CD-ROM, and mouse as you can see in this figure. Using an operating system, we can schedule different tasks at different timings and it will execute all these tasks as per the schedule. For example, let me give this particular PowerPoint for print. I go to file, I click on print, for now my printer is offline, I would click on print option and now if I go to my printer icon, these are the series of documents that are requested for printing. Depending upon the submitted or the scheduled time, the printer will print the document. So this entire process is controlled by an operating system. Let me also talk about a different example. This is my task manager and this has list of processes available here and for each and every process there is memory allocation and disk space. So the usage and allocation are controlled by operating systems as well. So there are different operating systems available in the market. Does anyone have any idea on that? Yes, there are like Windows, Android, iOS, Mac. Yeah, you're right. So as we all know, Microsoft Windows is the most popular operating system and most of the backend applications are running on Linux, which we will be talking about now. Let me talk about Unix first. Unix is the most powerful, multitasking and multi-user operating system and it is widely used in servers, mobile devices and workstations. So most of the web servers, application servers and databases are running on Unix. It was originally developed in 1969 by a group of AT&T employees at Bell Labs and it was completely written in C. These are the different flavors of Unix that are available as Sun developed Solaris, IBM developed AIX and HP developed UX. Now let's see what Linux is. Linux is also Unix-like computer operating system but it is an open source software development model as it is available for free. There are a lot of benefits that Linux offers to its users. For example, it is faster and secure. Viruses and spyware are non-issue on Linux and it provides high reliability and stability and performance. These are the different advantages that it offers. Thank you everyone for watching this video. Your feedback is highly important to improve our teaching methods. Let's meet in our next session.